Hello guys, welcome. As here with Mythic Games, actually visiting the awesome Steamforge Games studio to play some more God Tier. This time we're not having so much fun, we're taking it a bit serious. A little bit. Um, Alex and I are going to be putting a little bit of uh, company pride on the line a little bit. <laughs> not really, not really. <laughs> we're going to sit down, we're going to have another 2v2. Mm -hmm. um, Alex is going to be nice to me. We were thinking about going to 3v3 for the champions, but still in the early days of learning to play myself, so we thought we'd keep it simple. But to be honest, we've had loads of videos out before over on the Steamforge channel and obviously over on the Steamforge Kickstarter for God Tier. So you can go and check those out if you want to learn how to play, if you want to learn all about the latest version that we're currently on. This is not point eight that we're playing at the moment. So we're just going to dive into it. It's the growth scenario. 2v2, Wraith Marid and Rodri versus... Rangosh and Blackjaw. So I am like all in on murder. Uh, I'm his... guardian and shaper control. You're all in on death. Yeah. So you did like just as you were like talking through there. You, mm -hmm. I'm excited to see what the two ultimates do. Yes. I hadn't even thought about that. <laughs> that kind of is that is going to put a real, real cog dampener like, all over it. Yeah. Spanner in the works of my murder machine. But I'm intrigued to see how it goes. I hope so. Um, so shall we find out who goes first with a couple of dice? Yes. Maybe just. Yep. Let's see. I got I one. Got three. Would you like to choose or would you like to go first? I will go second. Okay. So I'll start off by probably being slow and steady. We'll get Rodri slap bang in the middle. We'll put two house guard either side of him with his new gorgeous female house guard as well. And up to you. This is where I pretend I know what I'm doing. Because oh. I'm the story of my life, man. I'm, so I, well, I'm the development lead on the game, so of course I know how it works and all the really good strategy. <laughs> no, that's why I picked two things that will run at you and hit you. Murder death is a legitimate strategy. You don't knock it. You're you're here to prove to everybody that you don't have to take things that murder to win. I, I hope I'm here I, to prove you're wrong. I don't. I think I'm here to prove that you can have fun and lose. <laughs> <laughs> So let's deploy Wraith, I'll pop him here. Um, if anyone hasn't seen the video uh, that went out on the Steamforge Games channel with Ben playing Wraith was an absolute fantastic game. He really... Clinic. Yeah, clinic is the word. I, if I can do him even half proud, I'll be elated. Um, I realise I've kind of screwed the pitch already by putting them maybe too far apart, but let's do... Let's see. Yeah, let's There's do There's no such this. thing as too far apart with Wraith Marid. No, he has, he has the range. It doesn't it's exist. Um, we're going to... He's a big boy, isn't he? Look at Rangosh, look at him. I love Rangosh. So yeah, if you were going up against a Maelstrom champion, someone that gains bonus points for culling followers, you'd be a bit more scared with 10 followers on the board. Yep, yep. I'm glad you don't have Maelstrom. Yep. Like if you had Blackjaw. Yep. Or Titus. Mm -hmm. Oh, stop the teasing, <laughs> stop the teasing. <laughs> I might be a bit more petrified. Um, I love, for me, like throughout all the development process of the game, like Rangosh has been god tier. I find it very <laughs> hard to play without Rangosh because he was, he was like Matt's initial idea, mm -hmm. this like massive minotaur guy yep. with his big whip. Um, I find it very hard not to play without him. It, it makes sense that a game has an iconic character, especially and, and for everyone it might be a different iconic character. I think that embodies their style of play and how they yep. want to do, especially with yep. so many different fantasy characters. Yeah, Wraith Marid's become like a big like cult favourite. Like he's, everyone seems to love Wraith Marid. He's the fanboy's character. I, yeah. uh, so I went first, so it means we start with one towards me. That is one. correct. Okay. All deployed? All deployed over to you for your plot phase. Okay, I don't think I'm going to do anything too crazy. I need to make sure I get this right though because this is the first time I'm using a, a shaper, mm -hmm. which means I need to really use these whirlpools properly. So they're now in version 0 0.8 able to pull things towards them. They are. Um, so I'm going to activate them first. We're going to simply have, they don't move, they simply use their uh, current to be placed three hexes away. So yep. I'll go one, two, three to here. Uh, this actually will go to there. Uh, this guy will go one, two, three to here. And this guy will go uh, one, two, three to here. Keep it reasonably spread out at the start. Yeah. Um, we're then going to have this guy. He's going to use Tide, which has a range of three, yep. um, to be a C, pop it on to uh, Rodri. Oh, see. Pull him forward. Get those little. This time the water's on your side, Rodri. <laughs> Slide on up, buddy. <laughs> Just run with it. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the whirlpool's all activated. 
Yeah. Um, for Rodri himself, he's going to activate next. Mm -hmm. No, I activated my followers. I know, first. I kind know of because I was, I was like, forced to, was but like, <laughs> no, <laughs> it was the right strategic thing I think in this case. Um, I will do Rodri next. The reason is I want to I want to buff Wraith now while he's still in range. So he's going to give Hold Hold, which is a reinforced to a friendly um, unit within three hexes, so he gains plus one to his protection. Mm -hmm. and then he's simply going to use his normal movement to move one. So he's up to here. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Uh, actually, no, let's go there. Being a bit more, a bit more focused this game. Uh, so Rodri's One of us gone. Needs to be. <laughs> I'll get the excuses in early, don't worry. I, I wonder which one is going to out-excuse the other. <laughs> um, I mean, we haven't even started rolling dice yet, so they started coming <laughs> My out. My dice so need no excuses, they're they just awful. Not, they, they really do not. I'm really looking forward to that. I mean, I, um, I have a dodge of four and a dodge of three here. I don't have a lower dodge than a three, so I, I don't think you're actually going to hit me because I've seen your dice roll. I would like to argue with you, but I fear that this might end up being correct. <laughs> Prophesizing right now, I don't land a single hit this game. <laughs> no, let's... Positive PMA, PMA. All right, Household Guard um, are just going to activate next, and I think... So my option is they're definitely going to move once. Are they going to move twice, or are they going to buff their armor? I think they're going to move... I don't have anything particularly ranged at this point. Yeah. It depends how deep you're going to be at the end of when they've gone in the tactical phase, really. Um, I think I'm just going to move them one, though. So one to here, one to there. And I'm just going to take the, the reinforce mm -hmm. for the protection buff. Um, the big thing, and it's something I really enjoy about God Tier, I mean, I want to focus on the game, but I'll just speak about it very briefly, is that they do keep the boons until something triggers until they them. use it. They don't go at the end of yeah. the turn. There's no, like, end turn cleanup. Yeah. The only thing that happens, at least in this scenario, at the end of a turn is more things yeah, get put exactly. on the table. Um, so it, it gives you... Because I, I can choose to run on up if I want to, or I can choose to take the time to hold back and wait to see what you do. And I yeah. think I'm a little hesitant, but I will do that. Mm -hmm. um, for Wraith, then... How brave is he feeling? This isn't him. This is how brave are you feeling? Oh, don't make me roleplay a man. <laughs> That's... Uh, <laughs> Yeah. I know if I looked like that, I'd feel significantly braver than I do yeah, on a day-to-day -day basis. Yeah, and he's pretty beef, isn't he? Um, I'm actually thinking... Yeah, he's going he's gonna to crisploosh mm -hmm. to take place of this uh, whirlpool, which means it'll trigger his trait, which means he's going to get a boon of my choice. Yes. Um, he's dodge two, protection three. I'm gonna, he's gonna, well, he's already got the protection boon, so I'll actually give him the dodge boon. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Yeah, we'll give him the dodge. Well, no, we're, do you know what? We're going to give him the quicken boon. Yep. Let's keep it. Let's keep that as an option. Uh, it might be very, very helpful in a moment, actually, especially with only that one move. I don't think there's anything else I really need him to do. He can't recruit sure he can't because it's not him that performs that. Um, he could jet. Yeah, let's jet. So he'll target this whirlpool, mm -hmm. move it up to three hexes. So let's bring it up to one, two, and three. Get out! Leave! No, just he's cute and fun and having fun. And that's me, that's my entire plot phase. And everyone activated. I feel like this is bait. Nope. I feel like this is bait. Nope. I feel like you want me to go boom, boom, nope. boom, Not boom, at all. boom. No. Just he's I know shooting. where my target is. <laughs> <laughs> I know where he is. Um, so I am going to. Dun, 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 dun. I know this the cutting edge interesting game where I'm sat here thinking about what I'm going to do. Hmm. It is one of those things, because when you're playing at home, you take the time to think you, you enjoy it, you have a chat while you're doing it, um, and obviously you can breeze through nice and quickly, but it's more it's it's a better game if you take a little extra second to think, yep. what actually feels right for me yep. here? So I am going to... Would it be, Ronan, would it be really bad if I took my phone out and took a picture of how amazing these minis look on the board? Got, like... Blackjaw and, uh, I've actually forgotten his name now, but Blackjaw uh, and Rangosh. Rangosh look just insane together. Mm -hmm -hmm. Alex is terrible at making decisions. So Rangosh is actually in range to do none of his okay. super fancy stuff. So he's going to go first and mm -hmm. he's just going to go one, two, yep. up to there. And then he's going to channel rage, okay. which gives him strengthen. Oh yeah, he looks like a guy who needs to be stronger. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah, he works out. Seems legit. He works out. <laughs> if you met him, he'd be the first to tell you he does CrossFit. <laughs> um, that's him done. The mercenaries. Oh, I'd really like 
really want to do fancy things, but it's not the right you thing to do. This is super you've, serious. You've plenty of time. So these guys are just going to move up, uh, and that is all they're going to do. Okay. Oh, guys and gal. Yeah. They're just going to move up. I'm just getting ready. Gals can be forming, mercenaries as well. Yeah. I'm forming the wall, the death wall. Um, they cannot ambush. Uh, they do not need to induct. And I'm not going to use their trait dirty thieves yet. Okay. So their trait dirty thieves means that they could take that off Rangosh and put it on themselves. Okay, gotcha. That's nice. Um, but I want it on Rangosh, because Rangosh is going to go and hit things, and he's going to hit them <laughs> hard. Um, then I believe we are going to go with Blackjaw, who is going to hot jaw, uh, hot foot his followers, okay. to give them plus one move, plus one speed. Uh, and then he's going to move up. So one, two, three. Mm -hmm. um, and then that's him done. Okay. And then his followers are going to go... Uh, and they are going to move. They're going to make an advance action. Four. One, two, three, four. Oh, wow, with that hot foot. They fairly haul ass across the table. Yes, they do. One, two, three, four. Okay, uh, okay. Quick and goes away. Yep. That's them done. Okie dokie. Over to you for your first of the clash phase. Okay, so I need to, I don't like the idea of your stuff creeping up the way it is. Mm. Okay, so with the Whirlpools, I'm going to recruit. Mm -hmm. Pull one here. Um, and then... Mm -mm -mm. Would it terrify you if I said they have a trait, which means I could have moved them again? It's... What? It's really? Like the Orc Savages can use the same action more than once per activation. Oh, so they can double move. But I didn't want to bring them that too That, that would deep be too deep, too I fast. Yeah, I don't yeah. want to go too far, but I could have. Yeah, that would have been... No, I wouldn't enjoy that at all. Um, okay, so I'm then going to move with the Whirlpools. Mm -hmm. um, now, they have the ability Light Water, which is once per phase during the Whirlpools activation, you may choose a boon on Wraith Mirrored, and they gain that boon. So, so I can use that can as well. You can use either... You can gain either Quicken... Or is it reinforced? Uh, yeah, quick and reinforce. reinforce. I'm going to give them reinforce. Yeah. And I'm then going to. That's just a free non. Yeah, it's action. just a trait. Yeah. They just um, get that, to do it. So they'll move. Well, again, they're using current to place themselves um, up to three hexes rather than. Mm -hmm. two, Which is I'm assuming why you didn't take the plus speed one. Yeah. Um, two over to here. Come back. <laughs> two, three. In fact, I'll move him one more. Mm hmm. Uh, I'm getting a little spread. I don't know if that's a bad idea against the impending doom. Yeah, I'm actually, yeah, I'm okay with that for now. Yep, that's okay. So it's back to you. That was the Whirlpool's activation. So basically recruiting, trading a buff, moving. Yep. Oh, do, 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 do. You, have, you have not made my life easy here. I kind of need you to make a move somewhere and then react to that a little bit. Yeah. You have a lot of guys, though. I do. I have so many guys. <laughs> so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kind of do uh, be a bit cagey. Mm -hmm. Not too cagey, but a little bit cagey. Uh, I'm going to go with my orcs. Yep. One, two. Mm -hmm. uh, what is their movement in this phase, two? Two, okay. yeah. And then I'm going to go one to there, one to there, and leave that one there. All right. Okay, okay. Interesting. Uh, and then these two mm -hmm. are going to make a cleaving strike sure. on on over there, mm -hmm. uh, which is only accuracy three, and I believe they are dodge four. They are dodge four. You never know. It's possible. No, nope. that whips. Um, that is them done. Okay. Um, I think my household guard are simply going to come up now. So they're going to first advance. So we'll see uh, one, two, one, two. Oh, I see. Uh, now you're splitting two. up, huh? Yeah. I see. Uh -huh. I only have four guys. They can only split, <laughs> you know, uh, three guys and a lady. Uh, they can only split so far. Um, so we'll do a one, two to here. And then they'll use their skill for marching to move an additional hex. So what we're going to do is go here, 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 and here. And that'll finish their activation. So cagey. 
Stop being so gay, Jake. Dwarves can't run five hexes, Mr. Orc, so... Oh, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> I'll give you that one. I do love the fact that they're, they're slow in the, the plot phase, but then speed up in the clash yep. phase. It feels right. Like they're gaining momentum. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, Rangosh, what do I want to do with you? I want to get you involved. You want to overcommit him trying to kill a whirlpool? That, that, that's the problem I do, <laughs> but I know I shouldn't. Um, so I am going to... So my mercenaries are going okay. to go. Yeah. They are going to use their skill Thug Life. Okay. Which remove I have to remove one. Sure. You so don't get any points. So for they're that. beating each other up. But the unit gains strengthen. Okay. And concentrate. So plus one on your damage roll and plus one on your accuracy roll. And then these three are going to use shoot. Okay. On this one. Okay. So there are three on there. So it's mm -hmm. accuracy five. Oh. And because I have concentrate. Goes up to accuracy six. Oh crud! Okay. Okay. Uh, so three dodge. I need to get lucky here. That's most definitely a hit. Don't yep. even need that spinner one. So I hit them. Yep. Uh, and then I am three on the damage. It's because they have a boon. It's three armor. Ooh, ho, ho. Could get away with this. Uh, additional one. Oh, could not get away with because this. Because strength. Gets Dude, away with it, away wow. With it. Now, no. If I'm completely honest to people, I kind of wouldn't mind you to win this turn, though. I would kind of like the ability to, to place the to hexes. Place and choose. Because with Shaper and Rodri as the Guardian, it could give me a lot of control. And I'm currently, just by the fact that no one's taking anyone out yet, winning. So yeah. this is actually a kind of a little bit of a problem for me. I almost feel like I need to maybe go on the offensive to take advantage of your lack of dice rolls and not killing anything yet. Yeah, I mean, possibly. It's a it's a peculiar one where turn one is such a decider yeah. because it's it, turn in any turn. Mm -hmm. Something I'm super happy with in the game is that there's there is a choice between yeah. whether you wish to go first or second. Absolutely, and there are positives that come out of losing a turn mm -hmm. that can put you towards winning the yep. second, uh, like the next turn. Um, well, I'm going to go with Rodri next. Uh, sorry, yeah, you're. I assume you're all done with your yes, mercenaries? yes, that is um, done. So he's got a move of two, so he'll just move up to here, mm -hmm. um, and then he's going to. Yeah, he's simply just going to use his movement to get to here. So he's going to use his uh, march skill march. for an extra one hex, and yeah. that is him. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. So black jaw. It really sounded like you were singing Barbie Girl there. Yeah. Ah, 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 yeah. I was. <laughs> I'm trying to work out. See, it was very smart spreading your dwarves out mm -hmm. to try and kind of limit what Black Jaw is capable yeah, of doing. Yeah, I've seen his AoE potential. It's vast. And so the like this is a very good play on your part. You, these oh, tend to be nice. difficult for Black Jaw anyway because yeah. th they spread out by mm -hmm. nature. But the spread out dwarves is frustrating. <laughs> um, but I'm, gonna, I'm not going to overextend because that's what you want. No, shh. One, two, so okay. an advance yep. from him, and then he's going to fireball <gasps> this one. You big bully. I know. I am an awful, awful person. So you're working on a dodge of two. And I have four accuracy. Okay. <gasps> and I whiff. Oh, wow. Black Jaw. He knows. He knows. He's he knows, right. that he's this, is, he knows this is good for me. He knows yeah, this it, is it good for me. It kind of is good for you. Yeah, which is kind of throwing, this up for a, throwing me a little bit for a loop here. Because I'm forcing you to come in um, and I'm luring you into the trap. What's Black Jaw's dodge and protection? He is dodge three, he is protection three. Okay. So is he all done? Yes, sorry, he so is just, done. So it just leaves me with Wraith. Because I would like to come in and potentially slash and dash him here, but I've only got three damage dice and I'm not the best dice roller in the world, so it might be better just to try and take out an orc. What's the armor on an orc? Uh, they are the same, three, oh. three. <laughs> oh. Like father, like son. Yeah. Uh, Maybe. I think limiting your numbers, though, might be better than actually trying to kill. I don't think I'm going to be going after kills for your no. champions this game. No. So he's got the plus one quicken, so yep. plus one movement speed, so he's going to move two to here. Mm -hmm. And then his slash and dash has raised range two, www.keep slash and dash range two petition.com. <laughs> oh, if you want if you, a new petition. <laughs> if you want to sign up to that <laughs> um, And so this is a six accuracy. Yes. On a dodge of three? Yes. And an armor of two. Armor of three. Oh, God, save us. Uh, Definitely okay, hits. we get the hit. Now it's only three dice on three. Come on. So I need four here. 
Nope. Three. So you match oh. on the three. So your your dice rolling's picked up since the last one. <laughs> but you did hit, so you do get the hit effect. Um, of which getting to move is essentially just going to be. Oh, I, I see. Think hit and run tactics. Yeah. Are we? Um, yeah. The fact that you're going to get to choose where these uh, next hexagons go it means you can't sit back too much. Yeah, it means because that's your plan, right? Yeah. Is to the, let the you come in. Game. Yep. Oh man. And I also, what's Rangosh's movement? Uh, he's movement three, uh, and he has a range two attack, which hooks you in. Oh, and he has an ultimate which lets him charge two? Uh, so his, his yes, his ultimate is move two hexes and then place two wound cubes on any adjacent champion. So I don't have to roll that. That is so, just two wound cubes. Although I don't necessarily want to go backwards, <laughs> I'm not going this direction. So yeah, that's no, going to be seems, seems fair. the end of his slash and dash. So I'm, int oh, I'm so intrigued here because everything about me says I go in and start hitting things. Mm -hmm. now, this is a target-rich environment for Rangosh, mm -hmm. but I know you don't want me to. Like, I, I, no, I know you want yeah. me to, sorry. I know you want me to. Just one, just so I get this, yeah. and then you get the control back mm -hmm. there. And this is playing the scenario, this exact position right now is all because we're playing growth rather than decay or any yes. of the new scenarios that are going to be yeah. coming out. Yep, exactly that. But I... I believe in fun, right? <laughs> yeah, okay. I believe that Rangosh would not sit back. He would not move and then sacrifice his second action for the okay. sake of winning a turn yes. and getting a degree of a foothold in Do the it. game. He would move up and he would try and murder something. I generally hope you swing at a dwarf and miss after all this talk. One, <laughs> two, three, yeah. up to there. And then he is targeting this dwarf okay. with a whiplash. All right. Which is accuracy. I shall double check my paperwork. It is accuracy five. Okay, you've only got a dodge of two. You're going to probably miss. <gasps> oh, it actually did. <laughs> it's written in the stars. It's written in the stars that that is not going to go well for me. Okay, so... That misses. I kind of wanted yeah, you to no, take this right. This, this is written in the stars. I feel like... I'm starting to feel good about this game because I was playing for fun there. I was playing for no. going in, giving you what you Strategy, like, Alex. No, no. It's no. the building. The building's <laughs> doing something. It's like, you, you remember, you are the pride of Steamforged here. Okay. You've okay. got to get this done. All right. Um, so we don't do fun we here. Do, we, we do, do fun destruction. We do, <laughs> or not. Apparently, I tried destruction. That didn't work. Okay, so end of this round, there's no banners to count, nothing else. The points literally did not move. Correct. Which means I will get one, because I went first. One, and then I will roll one of these. To decide how many hexes you put down. Two plus... Oh, that's two plus two, that's, that's four plus. hexes. What are you going to do with four hexes? I don't know. I actually don't I know. I would have loved to place four hexes. I could just go bam, bam, cut off all those guys, run away. Like... That's epic. I don't know where I want them. I don't think your side wanted a lot of hexes on this no, board. No, no, I wanted it as small as possible. Yeah. Because the more I spread them out here, yeah. if you, Wraith just jumps yep. behind and then I've got to run the opposite mm -hmm. way. Absolutely. Like, I kind of just want to put these to grow it in this area. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Keep it centralised where you can get me. And I also don't want to cut off my own guys too much. So I think it's one there. Oh, what an interesting development. One there. One there, and one there. Ooh, that's spicy. Cool. Now it's one fin Whoa. short of an adorable looking terrapin. Oh, <laughs> man. Uh, and I get the choice of who goes first or second. And I'm going second. You're going second? Really? I'm going second. All right, okay. All down, all down. And there is a reason behind that, and that's because I know what you're going to do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Oh, He's going to double ultimate. I really <laughs> consider <laughs> double ultimate right now. And um, if I went first, I would be moving in to a point where you could hit them both with both of yeah. them. And I don't want that. Oh, I want you God. to have to pick where they go. I want you to have to use both to get me far away. Oh, <laughs> this is <laughs> awesome. Okay. Um, I don't know if I can protect it. I really generally don't know if this is the right thing to do, but it feels like the fun thing to do. Um, so Rodri is going to plant his banner. Okay, so you get point. one. 
and he's going to ultimate. Okay. So move all enemies within three hexes of Rodri's banner up to two hexes away from Rodri's banner in the order you choose. Yep. So let's start with the super easy ones. Um, the super easy ones are this one, so two hexes. Yeah. Um, Rangosh is relatively easy. He is going just two hexes. Mm -hmm. um, this guy is just going two hexes back that way, please. Back to the deployment zone. Um, I think all in all, it's probably going to be just more of the same over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, did I move him? Yeah, two. Now parting the seas. <laughs> um, <laughs> and black jaw then. Just two. Um, uh, one, uh, two. Two to there. <laughs> so that's Rodri. Yeah. Ultimate gone. Here's Rodri. Banner down. Oh, yeah, I know. I'm all about seeing that right now. Um, okay, so the House Guard are going to activate. Mm -hmm. So they're going to advance first. Yep. Then they're going to use the skill. Oh, I see. These guys feel safe, do they? They're, then they're going to, up together, then they they're going to use the skill to march, and they're going to... Um, oh, Blackjaw's made some friends. Oh, God. I know. <laughs> I'm, putting, I'm putting followers beside Blackjaw, which I know against a Maelstrom champion is not the best idea, but they're separate. They're strong. They have a buff. They have the boon for reinforce, so... They just need to hold yeah. the line for a little bit, yeah, potentially. Yeah, keep them busy. Um, then we've got the whirlpools. So this whirlpool, I'm going to do uh, essentially current. So yeah, yeah. place three to here. Uh, this one will... No, come back. Stay sure. No. One, one, two, three to here. Um, yep, this one will go... One, two, three to here. Stop running away. This one is going to tide yep. here. Yep. To roll five dice on Durangosh. Four dodge on the big man. Come on, let's pull He's him backwards. For a big one. That's a three. Yes. That is a I'm three. I'm secretly very happy I about really that. I really want to can pull deal, him. I can deal with that far away. <laughs> Damn it. I know it sounds silly. You had one like job with a one, one, one hex job. is so important, and if I'd yep. lost that one, then I'd be. Oh, damn. Um, okay, Wraith Marid then is going to curse Bloosh. Mm -hmm. So from here, oh, I put it one too far away. You can put it back. I have no problem with uh, that if you want to move it back one. Thank you. No I worries. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, now I shall curse yeah, Bloosh. Yep. Um, swap it from here to here. Uh, gaining a boon. He currently has uh, reinforced for plus one uh, protection. He'll take plus one. Dodge. Boo. Dodge. Is dodge right? Yeah, dodge feels okay. Yeah. Um, then he's going to plant a banner. Ooh. Interesting. Here. And he scores two for that um, as a shaper. Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm washing my hands of this situation. Is that you done? It's over to you, sir. I'm not like, I, had my, I had my one tech back. It doesn't. Feel great knowing you still have that legendary there. Like, it was smart play because it means when I come back in, I'm going to be going back out again. Hopefully so. So I just need to bear that in mind and not overcommit, mm -hmm. not collapse in on the middle yep. so that you have to choose who you're shoving yep. away again. So where am I starting? <laughs> where am I starting? That to there, that to there. Boop, boop, boop. At some point with God tier, I will eventually start to learn and, and understand that your minions, your banners, your champions, all the hexes, they all are so crucial to the entire movement and flow of the game. And I'm looking at my two banners going right now and going, I should have maybe split them up a little. I keep quite close. Yeah, they're quite close. Because I've kind of cornered Rodri with people and the banners, um, meaning he's going to have a bit of a tough job to get involved in the upcoming clash phase. So that's the separation of the plot and clash phases allows for so much movement. Yes. Is he going to run away from the dwarves? One, he is. Two, Look at the big chicken. Three. Big chicken. Um, and then he is going to mm -hmm. quicken himself. Well, damn. 
So what, what does that put him to movement speed for next round? Three. Three, okay. Then... Oh, ho hum, ho hum. The Orc Savages... Uh-huh. ...are going to move. Probably not surprisingly. Back together? Back together. Okay. Uh, these ones are going to move over to here. Mm -hmm. um, and then these ones are going to use intimidation. Okay. On uh, that. Are you trying to stun there. me? Okay. I'm trying to stun you. Um, so dodge of two. And that is accuracy six. <laughs> so to give you an idea, that's if there's one of them, yeah. it's accuracy one. Oh, okay. If there's two of them, it's accuracy. So it, the more of them there are, the it's more intimidating it is. Makes perfect sense. Okay, so this should... Yes. And then some. So, so he loses a dodge. Yes. Oh, that's not too bad. They're not really dodgy anyway. No. That's okay. No, no, no. Um, that's them done. Okay. Consider yourself... Intimidated. Um, Blackjaw, not Blackjaw, Rangosh. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I could turn him this way if you want. Uh, <laughs> oh, what an appealing it's, yeah. target. <laughs> uh, he's going to go one, two, to yeah. there. And then he is going to make an attempt at break spirit. Okay. Uh, and he's going to give a go on these guys, which is also a, a stun. Okay. Uh, it's accuracy of five. Range okay. two, accuracy so five. Dodge four. Dodge four. Makes it. Yes, so they are stunned also. Oh, no, no, that is losing a dodge on them is actually yes. kind of kind of bad. Um, that's him done. Uh, and then the mercenaries. The mercs. That's range one. You've ruined my plan there. <laughs> oh, God, I could, and it would be glorious. I'm going for it. Oh. I'm going for it. No, it doesn't work. I can't go for it. <laughs> I wanted to go for it, but I can't have it. Want it? Can't have oh, it. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to induct. Okay. Um, which is similar to the recruit rule. Mm -hmm. However, I can place them, rather than placing adjacent to him, okay. I place them in a hex containing these. Nice. So they're bringing along their own followers. They're yes, just yeah. they're mercs. They re they're inducting guys as they go. They're not necessarily entirely buying into Rangosh's sure. thing, but they're along for some murder. <laughs> um, and then they are just going to make an advance. Okay. Um, one, two, mm -hmm. and one, two. So they are stomping on up. That's them. That's everything. Okay. Over to you, sir. Clash phase. Wraith Marid. He's been waiting for it. Black Jaws come up. It's threatening the banner. He's threatening the god tears. He's threatening the energy, and he's going to whip him with a headbutt. Oh, I see. Yep. Uh, so I am dodge three. Four dice. So this, this is a big roll. Historically, role. this is a one and two blanks. Oh, uh, three blanks. Historically, that's what this roll is. When I, whoa, no, no, that doesn't go. When I roll four of these dice, historically, but not anymore because I'm playing with Reed. You're a changed man. I'm a change shaper. Please. It misses. I'm so sad that it, it's, more, it's more upsetting that it's not only a miss, but it's not the, <sighs> the textbook as rolled. I know. If it had been three blanks and a one, I'd be happier that it missed than this. But you missed by one. Because that could have been five damage and a move of two hexes, which could have got him out of banner killing range. Yeah. So you've only got one other option to get him out of banner killing range that I'm aware of. Um, and that's with, your ultimate. With Wraith, it is my ultimate. And I do not want to do that at <laughs> all. I really, really don't want to do that. Because it only gives me this round, and yeah. that would mean I still have to win the third or fourth round to even have a chance, and I'd be two ultimates down. Yep. If I lose two banners, I'm still four to nothing right now. You are. So it's not the end of the world. Oh, God, that was a big roll. My murder boys haven't been murdering yet, no. so I am... No, they I've haven't. Been, it's been a slow start. Okay, I'm just going to tr oh, try and give a slash and dash. That's tricky. Yeah, let's just try and slash and dash. You going for black draw again? Yep. Oh, yep, that's what's happening. So, six dice. It is indeed. Dodge of three. three. 
No. Hmm. Oh wow, as you've really That's a new record for five blanks and a one. You've really I thought you turned a corner after that last one, but mm mm mm. Old boy. Uh, he's back, guys, he's back. I didn't hit, so I don't get to move. Oh no, it's after using this skill, I may it move. It does hit effects. Yeah, no, it says it just says after using this skill, move Wraith Mode up to two hexes. So I believe you get to Yeah. Okay. Um so that's at least even us losers who can't roll any dice still get something from it. Um so I'll go both. Ooh, yes. Yep. 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 Okay. Over to you, sir. Okay. I don't want to. I can't really play around with this. No. Not too much. So you're going to see. This is why I wanted that quicker. Yep. So that I can not only get rid of these two, but mm -hmm. I can get back to here yep. to start beating these guys Lovely. up as well. Lovely. Just do your so proper one, two. And round to here. Yep. And no, no victory points to be given because crushing yep. is no longer uh, a victory point reward. Yep. Uh, that goes away. Yep. Oh, lovely. And then I'm going to go for a kick on a dwarf. Okay. Uh, so it's six accuracy. Minus one dodge. So one dodge. If you want to roll six blanks, that'd be swell. <laughs> no deal. <laughs> <laughs> That's a total of ten. Um, protection three with a boon. So right. four protection. I should have saved that roll. So it's five. Okay. Uh, protection of three, was it? Four, because I had a bit. Four, because you got the boot. Oh, not. what is happening? Uh, I'll have those two points. Thank oh, you very much. What is? Uh, and I get another action. You absolutely my trait, do. And I am going to use Fiery Axe. Like it. Like it. On this one. So two dodge. Accuracy four. No. Yes. Oh, yes, of course. You're only two. The they're silly dwarves. If you'd you love to miss it, I'd be, I'd be grateful. Silly dwarves. So three protection. Um, and four damage dice. Oh, this is bad. No, Ooh. fine. Ooh. Ooh. That's, I really needed that. I really Ooh. did. Black Jaw, I can't be disappointed. You've done me well. Um, um, that's him done. Oh, man. What now? Big turn, Black Jaw. Yeah, that was, that was a, a bad turn Wraith and a big turn Black Jaw. That really was not nice. Um, okay. God, I really need to... And the okay. gosh is looming. The gosh is the looming. The gosh is looming. And so how far can he move in this phase? Uh, three. Three, okay, so pulling him back is really not And you've got, I've got his opposite. I could move five if I wanted to I use my I could charge and move together. Oh, brutal, brutal, brutal. Um, okay, so let's do uh, a dwarf activation. Mm -hmm. um, so... This guy's gonna move forward to here. These two are gonna stay where they are, mm -hmm. I think. E yeah, they're gonna stay where they are. Mm, and we're gonna crude. do. Um, do I need to put two in? Yeah, you don't have any AOE on the side of the table. No, right? they don't. Have so any. I actually think I'll bring them together. But they can repeat the same action, including their skills. Oh, that's so it. They could yeah. hit one. I mean, well, even I when they're split yeah. up, I can still. Um, so we'll go like this, and then we'll um, yep. do attack in. So same dodge three. Looking same at. As, same as. Papa Black Jaw. Five accuracy. Uh, yes. Easy. Um, and four, because there's two of them on the damage dice. Yes. Armor three. Armor three as well, yeah. Oh, goodness. Ooh. Nope. It's not going to do it. Oh, man. All right, that's those guys gone. That's them done. I'm not sure what I want to do here. I'm in a, I'm in a weird spot where Wraith's gone, so yep. I'm not too bothered about killing these. Absolutely. But... This guy's so far out. If I get rid of that one, you have to use a recruit yeah. on their yeah, activation. Absolutely. Um, and they're currently down a dodge. They're down a dodge, yeah. so I want to do something reliable. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Okay, you're out of range of these guys, which ruins my plan mm -hmm. a little mm -hmm. bit. Because I would ideally. Oh. Okay, so I am going to go for an advance with these guys. Yep. Slowly coming up. They'll go one to there, two to there. No, okay, do we? Uh, and the others are just going to move up to here. Cautiously does it. Uh, and then these ones are going to perform a shoot yep. on this guy. Okay. So it's accuracy Ooh. five. So we're down to a dodge of three with the stun. Yes. Oh, hits. Hits. So an armor of two. And I get three dice at it. Mm. Oh, I'm so tempted. 
You got an extra ability you want to throw in? No. You're thinking about stealing... Oh, you got it. You got it. Bye bye. Oh, man. Oh. Okay. That felt good. Yep. I did, that I weirdly did that feel good for you. Like does that <laughs> did, was that like does that feel a bit like? Do you know what I wonder? Or are you just was it like, was like, it, I wish I knew I wish what I that could felt kill, like. I wish I could kill a whirlpool man. That's exactly what it feels like. Yeah, that is it. Uh, that's those guys done. Back over oh, to you. Oh man. Uh, okay. Rodri's gonna move up. We're gonna take a swing on the orcs. No. Yes. Uh, dodge three. Ooh, dodge three. Yes. It's pronounced Rodri. Rodri, what I keep saying. No, it's Dodge 3 sounds like... Rodri. Like, <laughs> rod, I don't know. It was a better joke in my head than it was when I said it out loud, like most of the things I say. Well, I hope I punish your terrible yeah. joke with a sword slash. <sighs> you do not. My good. Um, and now you've gone to consistently rolling two on four I dice. I don't, it's, I don't it's, know it's what's Next happening. Next game, you're going to be on three. Like, it's just gradually going to keep building. I, 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 yep. 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 Over to you, I mean, sir. You don't need to murder. You're good. That's my yeah. thing. Yeah. You need banners. Oh, wait. I need. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Does that one Shot to does the that heart. one? Yeah. I was going to say, does that one hurt? That one, that one was rough. Yeah. Um, so the orcs are going to go. Mm -hmm. They are not happy bunnies. No. They are going to cleaving strike the uh, this dwarf. Can I, can I interest you in a road ring? Not yet. Okay. That's not yet. No. Good answer. No. Good answer. Yeah, no, I'm going to start with your small dwarfs, and <laughs> yeah. I'll move on to the main of the Rodri, yes. and then sushi for dessert. I'm Currently, there's a, there's, we have like a, an infestation, a dwarf infestation going on over here. <laughs> we need to kill the numbers, get the numbers down before we go for Mama Bear. Yeah. But don't worry, there's a, we have a professional. He knows what he's doing, <laughs> but he doesn't deal with small fry. They're not, he's, I they you. are not worth him. I got you. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go for a mm -hmm. uh, cleaving strike here, which yep. is an accuracy of four, mm -hmm. because there are three of them, which hits. Yes. And then it is damage five. Uh, protection three. At uh, four, thanks to being beside Rodri. Yep, so nothing because right? they are next to Rodri, I yes. believe so. Yes. So nothing because it's next to Rodri. Mm -hmm. uh, and because of the skill frenetic, get sorry, again. the trait again. frenetic, we're going for the same again. Cool. So accuracy four. Yep. Dodge two, hits. And so uh, protection three plus one four. Oh, that time. Oh, that time. Thank oh, you. That's <laughs> huge. Oh, it's so big. Oh. Um, and that's them done. God dang it. Yeah, this is this has not been a good turn. All right, so Speak World Pools. World Pools. <laughs> glorious. <laughs> World Pools it is. We'll do a uh, recruit. Mm -hmm. And actually, let's do it here. And then we'll do uh, current to essentially um, place within three. So yep. one, two, three. And then one, two, and two, three to here mm -hmm. and that's that oh right it's not much left for Rangors to gobble up at this point is he gonna have a morsel is he is he gonna have a so is this I've got last activation haven't I mm -hmm. so it doesn't as much as I would love to kind of try and do something big I yep. think the right thing is to just set up ready for next absolutely um, yep. so I'm going to attempt to mm -hmm. whiplash that little dwarf. Oh. I'm going to go for the whiplash. What do you mean? Which I believe is accuracy five. Okay. Yes, because so I failed it miserably last time I tried it. Dodge a two. That'll do it. Uh, so now I get to place him mm -hmm. next to Rangosh. Oh. Which means he loses the protection buff from and being now beside you. The one. damage. The damage is four. So three. Like that, moving him could be the Up thing that to does five. it. five. Nice. <gasps> Gone. Yep. Oh, that's a two point. No, he's a slayer. He's sorry. a slayer. But then, as my second action. <sighs> oh, wow. Sup, Rodri. Sup, buddy. How you doing? Rodri is, is outnumbered to the absolute How you max. Do? If there ever was a scene for a guardian. Yep. yep. This is a get away from my god tears. Um, that is my final activation, and that yep. is the turn, I believe. So, you're going to take round two, two points to one. Let's yes, find out sir. how many new objective hexes we put down. Ah, oh, come on, <laughs> come on. Oh, you've got your own little stack. Yeah, I do. 
My stack's way smaller. I would have. Because uh, I had to put four down. <laughs> <laughs> I would have loved to play as four here. Come on, finish the terrapin off. Come on. The adorable little terrapin that's going on over here with his four little flippers and his head <laughs> and his little body in the middle. <laughs> oh, man. I feel like, so the options are expand down this way, give Wraith more to deal with. Expand down that way and try and flip the side of the board yeah. and cause you more issues. Um, if, man, if I could have got a couple more, I could really have encased Training. these guys a little bit. Wrap them up. Um, oh, man. Yeah, you are all up in my grill. So... There's only one dwarf left. There is only... No, there's a wee one over there. There's two dwarfs, technically. Technically. There He's a bigger dwarf, but there's still two. Um, I mean, what I'm trying to say is there's only one dwarf left. Stop it. Stop <laughs> it. Leave him alone. He didn't do anything to you. Um, you know, the last samurai. This is the last guardian. You're so mean. Um, oh, man, this is a real big decision. You're really right up in me, and mm -hmm. I need you to not be. So hi. Best can knocking I on the door. Is anyone home? Knock, knock, knocking on the guardian's door. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, what I would have done for an extra hex or two. Okay. Now I have to decide if I go first or second. You do. Um, so for round three, this is really the big round. This is the three pointer. So this would give you the game. It would give me the game. On oh, a three turn game. The humiliation. I think. After I failed miserably to try and win, or yeah. trying to win turn one. I knew this would happen. It was a premonition. I wanted to win turn one because I didn't want to do this to you. But at least you got a turn. At least I got a turn. Pat on the back. Thanks. You're, you're a good kid. You're a good, you're, you're a good egg. I'm saying this. I know his ultimate's coming and uh, I'm quite tightly packed still. Um, but Rodri's where it needs to be. Yeah, he's in um, trouble. He is. Um, I'm going to go... For, I really want to go second because it's banner. If you want to go second, if you're putting banners down, that really is the advantage. Because it thing. basically means that you you don't have to try and guard them yeah. for a strategy phase. Oh, nearly. Oh, a ploy Pl phase. Yeah. Plot. Plot. Clash. Got there in the end. <laughs> Plot. So many different names we've gone through. Um, yes. But going first here would be amazing for me because it guarantees I get a good Wraith ulti. Because right now, where Rodri is, this would be the place to Wraith ulti for me right now. Yeah. Um, but. That means going set. It means it means going first, and you getting the chance to go after banners. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go first. I think. Okay. Yeah, I think I need to. I think I have to ensure that this goes I think, down. I, I think this is one of the, a really interesting one where there's positives to both. Yep. Um, so. But one of oh. the positives is kind of like guaranteed. So just like you know, if you legendary or sorry yep. ultimate, yep. then things are going flying. And you know. That. Yeah, we're going here. Yeah. And then we're bantering. Here. Yeah, you run away, you smelly dwarf. Ah, uh, he's, he's loving life. He's loving life. Um, yeah, so that's Rodrigo gone. Mm -hmm. We're then going to Whirlpool. Yeah. Um, so I, I'm probably going to recruit with one. Yeah, recruit with one. Yeah. And then I would uh, current. So one, two, three. Yep. So to here. And actually, you, no, let's, leave, let's leave sure him there because that's where Wraith wanted to go. Yeah, right? but he's got Wraith is going to skadoosh in here. One, two, three, four. He's going to, uh, isn't he? Yeah, Kuplush. And what's what's his ultimate do? Uh, oh, you actually move him. Yeah. Oh, but I'm oh, I'm not going to be able to move him far enough. Well, I don't need to move him. His oh, I do have to place him. I do actually have to place him. How far is his ultimate? Is it three? Uh, up to three. Or within three. Yeah, so three. he needs to be able to move okay. one. So yeah, ideally, so I need, this I guy you. doesn't yeah. want to be here, but you can move um, him from So there, Well, so. yeah, we'll just basically put him here then. Um, and then... And do you want to give those guys one of the boons that Wraith's got? Yeah. Uh, thank you for reminding me of that. No worries. Two, one, two, three. And this guy will just go... One, two, is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, what is this the Bermuda Death Triangle of what's okay. <laughs> this going yeah. on here? So we'll grab the dodge boon from yep. Wraith. Uh, so with Wraith then, yep. we will... Yeah, I didn't. I forgot that yeah, he moves as part of his ulti. So we, we kersplush to, kersplush to here, mm -hmm. um, which means I'm going to grab myself a boon. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not sure what boon. I'm going to give him the accuracy boon. Yeah, I think that's the right call. Yeah. 
Um, then uses ultimate tsunami, so place them on an empty hex within three, and then all models on adjacent hexes are moved up to. Oh, sorry, up to three. You're parking them in the middle. Sorry. Um, so that's all. So you can move oh. your own. You can move Rodri as well. If you oh, okay. To. I never even thought about that. Um, and again, I, I assume I choose. And it's up deck. to two, and the order yeah. is your choice. So you could, you can move Mod Rodri, but you can just leave him where he is if you want. Two, three, and. And you can also One, split two, these guys three. up. They don't yeah. all have to go in the same direction. One, two, three. And put them there. One, two, three. And these guys. One, two, and then one each. And Rodri, are you cool where you are? I think you're cool where you are. Yeah, Rod is just going to chill. Up. Yeah. High hey, buddy. High five. Things Thanks. are about to get really bad. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, you saved me, water dragon. I don't, yeah. I, okay, so Rodri's going to activate. Yep. So Rodri's going to do, uh, is this, yeah, is this the way I want to do this, actually? Yeah, Rodri's going to activate because he'll do uh, recruit. Mm -hmm. oh, it's essentially, it's at, at my side, so his unit performs a recruit action. Has Rodri it's, been already? Uh, oh, sorry, forgive me. Down. My apologies. You're absolutely right. I'm jumping ahead of myself. So I do a recruit with the household guards. Sorry. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then I, I thought that's do... where you were going with the with Rodri, and then I was like, wait, at my side, that's a Rodri. Uh, thing. Wait, Rodri's been. Uh, are you cheating? Trying to badly. <laughs> um, so yeah, Wraith's gone. Rodri's gone. The whirlpools have gone, and the dwarfs are gone. Right now, I need to try and unpick this puzzle. Huh. 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 Come on, be brave, Wraith. Get turn turn back around and face your foos. I have dropped both ultimates though, and you can win on this turn, but I can't. So this is a more important turn for me. It is. And you still got both, both of the oh. ultimates. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. And I'm not gonna lie, I might end up just ending Wraith Marid. Do it. I mean if it's he's buffed, I mean he's he's currently dodge buffed, he's uh, protection yeah. buffed, so Weirdly, I, mean, I think Rag Rodri would be the right one to go for. I can get there. How peculiar that's isn't that crazy yeah, that he's yeah. a I mean Four protection. Four protection though is high. Four is high. Four is high. But I can have I get basically my my ultimate is two guaranteed damage on someone. Which will take so it's three basically health, yeah. Take him down by three, or is it five on Wraith that I need to get? So he's, seven? he's seven, yeah. And he's currently, what is he, dodge three, protection he's, four. Yeah, currently with both boons. Versus dodge two, protection four yep. permanently. So I think Wraith is the right... Interesting math. Sometimes when I'm playing situations like this, I really wish I was a but better But it's easier for Wraith to get away. Yes, absolutely, if you, if you feel it. Whereas if you, you could follow up next turn on Rodri, and this turn's not a lose the game turn for you, so... <laughs> oh, well, did that ultimate really did. That's a really good free screen, that one. Um, one, yep. two, three. Hello, buddy. Quicken himself. No. Oh. You can push me away. But I know. I will only come back but stronger. You all, yep. <laughs> oh, man. Yep, that's him done. Okay. Black Jaw, the banner monitor. That's his thing. He's got a little ribbon that says it on yeah. it. Banner mon no banners in my hallway. <laughs> um, I'm annoyed about the, the spreading of my orcs. That is a pain. <laughs> that is a pain. I'm now trying to look ahead and see if is there is there any way I can get Black Jaw away from this banner. How quick are they? Their speed two. Yeah, if I th if I thought further ahead, I think something I might have potentially changed if I was doing that. You, you keep working away. If I, if I changed it, it would have been to put the hexes more towards the back of the field and push Rodri with the tsunami to give him the ability to put his banner one or two hexes further away. If I had uh, first my first my very first game with Wraith, so I'm happy to learn that little trick for next time. So these guys are going to move. Sorry, make an advance mm -hmm. to there. You just are a dwarf killer. These guys are going to make an advance. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm actually going to only put him to there so they can join back up. Okay. 
Um, then I'm going to use Ambush. Okay. Which is some rare damage. In the plot phase? In the plot phase. Range one, it's accuracy five, because they're all together. If I hit, target gains one damage cube. Oh! That's filth. Yep. I don't care about the fact you're standing next to Rodri. Yep. I do not care one bit. So it just ignores armor, it's just that we shank round between the, the plates of this plate meal. <laughs> yep. That's, and that's good target choice for the skills. Yes. Damage cubes are definitely better than uh, than raw damage dice at times. Oh, plot phase damage cubes, man! What? Oh, no. It's like I'm cheating. Maybe I am. I not be in the card after I love all. It. I love it. I love it. Um, oh, I, do, I have to be so careful with my placement here because I don't want to get in Rangosh's way too much. So as much as it may look like surrounding here, <laughs> it's so easy for him to jump out that surrounding. Mm -hmm. There's no point in surrounding mm -hmm. trying to surround him. Um, if, but I do want to... Uh, I am going to... So that's the, them done, sorry. Yep. Then I'm going to go with the Orc Savages, and they are speed three. One, two, three to there. One, two to here. Mm -hmm. One, two, three mm -hmm. around to here. And... No! Leave him alone! Two to there. His whole family! His sister and his two brothers! Like. And then... What, who do I do it on? Who do I do it on? Uh, they are going to go for... These two are going yeah. to go for an intimidation on Wraith. Okay. Okay. So it's accurate. From that far away? Pfft. Oh wait, you're right. It's range one, so it will be these guys over here. Oh, I, I didn't. Did I didn't. I didn't cheat. mean to. I didn't mean to oh, roll no, check you, you there, correct. but no, you are correct. Um, so I do it with these guys because okay. they are range one, and it is three accuracy. You did two dodge. Oh yes, you're so there. Minus one, minus one dodge on those guys. That's okay. done. Really don't mind that too much. Uh, that's that one done. Um, big I man just time. Have the big, big man, man time. So what do oh, I want I to just do? Look at him. I know what I want to do, but I know what you're going to do when I do it. <laughs> I hope I know what you know what I'm going to do, because I don't know what you know what I should know. <laughs> I'm lost now. I have no problem saying I'm going to try and push Black John so he cannot get that banner. That's all my brain's on right now. So because it, it's an interesting, mm -hmm. there's like an interesting dilemma going yeah. on, and I'm going to try and take advantage and of that. force it. Yep. Move one, yeah. move two, yeah. ultimate. Oh, so this move is the charge, one, yeah. Move two, yeah. But now I need to decide which one gets two damage cubes. Ooh. I'm not I'm not I'm not saying a word. Cause I don't I know I don't know the right answer. <laughs> so you got a seven health wraith, who's easier to kill but has two more health than Rodri on five. Rodri would only have three health left, but he has got that protection four. It's on Rodri. It's on Rodri? Just straight up, do you, don't, do you have to roll to hit? No. Nope. nope, you just land up, gore him with your yes. tusks. Just, it's so that oh. one is named Beastly Charge. Love it. And he just runs up and spears you with his horns. Um, so I will flip his card over to show yeah. I've used his ultimate. Um, if someone else was on the table doing that, they would have done that for both of their characters too. Maybe, <laughs> who knows though. Um, so I still have the speed here. I still have those there. Mm -hmm. That's everything. Deal with that problem. <laughs> <laughs> what is uh, what is his movement in the three clash? Oh, oh what? <laughs> go on, go ahead, push him away. Oh, so I actually can't stop. Uh, where? Ooh. Yes, I can. Can I? Maybe. Okay, Rodri. I mean, what? I mean, the fact of the matter is, there's more than one way to remove a banner. Oh. <laughs> so you're so mean. You're so mean. Uh, okay. I don't have to walk on it. I can just get rid of the guy that owns it. What is the dodge on? Um, uh, God, I keep forgetting his name. Just four. What is his name again? Rangosh. Rangosh. I'm going to keep forgetting his name to belittle how not intimidating he is. Um, <laughs> so his dodge is four. His armor is two. Oh, okay. Okay. Six health. Rodri's going first. Rodri's going to try and shield bash. Yep. Blackjaw. Okay. Uh, he is dodge three. 
No boons. No boons. Well, speed is sped up, but that's it. Yeah, yes. you hit. So move target see. up to two hexes. Mm -hmm. So I move them to here, so please. There, then there, right? No, move them to here. Come on. Now is this back to back? No, hold on. There me... it is. That's an action shot. <laughs> oh, give me, give me a second. Hold on, hold on. Put it back first. Oh man, there's no way I can do this. Is there? there's no way I can. Oh, no, I thought I, I had it in my head that if I moved into here and then I moved across, but then Rag Ragnaros is just going to go Ragnaros. Uh, Rangosh. Rangosh. And if you go to here, he's still in range to get there. Ah, uh, this. You've activated sucks. my trap card <laughs> so much. I'm gonna have to fight my way out of this. Am I? Is that, <laughs> trying to kill one is of that them. what's gonna have to happen? So we're gonna push him to to here. Yep. Right next to a small door. Thank you. Square uh. one. Oh, Getting in your head now, as oh, man, <laughs> get out of my head, dude. Get out of my head. Um, God. And then Just I'm, so you're aware, here yeah. he's still in range yeah. to get around. I know. I know. Himself. This is gonna sound really crazy, but I'm basically just gonna march to here. Interesting. To there. My thought is, if Rangosh is gonna go after the banner, he's not killing stuff. Yep. So. Kill stuff or go get my banner, or kill stuff and then go get the banner. Or just kill him and then, and then the banner goes. Shh, you're not going to kill. You're not, <laughs> this is all part. Are you convinced? This I'm is all part it. of my plan that Rodri is going to be able to survive anything you can throw at him because he's a beast. That I mean, yeah, I mean, yep. it's not terrible. He's a beast. It's not a terrible plan if I'm honest. Okay. Apart from the fact that Jawbreaker has a hit effect that moves the target up to one hex away from Rangosh, so all I have to do is hit him, and then Blackjaw can just skip through. No, that's not going to happen. Really I hate you so much. <laughs> they hit you. But no, to be fair, like I, the plan was just kill him. Yeah. Uh, yep. And as much it as I can like sit a... here and try and get in your head, and as much as Jawbreaker does have seven damage dice as standard, <laughs> um, which, assuming... I was to roll at least one on each dice means minus your four off that all you'd like. He's still yeah, gone. Yeah, he's still gone. Yeah. It's, there's still like there's still a decision to be made. However, I can do that jawbreaker, mm -hmm. and if it doesn't kill him, still boop, boop, just absolutely. Go and get it. Um, You're so, gonna miss uh, it. He's got a dodge too. I mean, it's only three accuracy. Like it is not accurate. So it hits this hard, is, but it could miss. It could miss. But Rodri, if there ever was a. a <laughs> you know, person a post, a, post a target for jawbreaker for the side of, side of a barn robbery yeah. just so I'm going to go for that so go Rangosh then. is going to go we're going to go for the talk. jawbreaker yeah, yeah. go on jawbreaker oh please is it just two I need right it's is just, that it it's just, just two, two you need. need just two <gasps> Is the is the is the two off Does camera? Was the two on camera? Is it is it? Oh, it's so. Oh, you're filthy. Two blanks and a two. So just to what was the dodge? Sorry, no, just to clarify, it was, it was, it was two, two it was, right? It was two. Yeah. Hang on, um, Ronan, can we like cut to cut to an ad break just while I gather my seven dice? <laughs> <laughs> sorry, what was your protection? Uh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> 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 so I need to roll seven and he's gone, basically, right? <laughs> do, 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 do. Come on, four, four. Oh my god. It's not, he's not dead. Is that six? It's six. <gasps> One shy. He takes two damage. No, I'm just saying, would Rangosh go for the banner at this point? Really? Would he? So would he go for the banner? I don't feel like he would. I get to move Rodri one. Um, Jawbreaker has a hit effect. <sighs> So I'm just gonna. The studio is so well lit. That there's nowhere for me to look <laughs> to like console myself. <laughs> so I'm gonna push Rodri around to here. Yep. Because that seems like the smart thing to do. Uh -huh. Now I do have a ranged attack. To Which you're gonna do because you're a man. To you're try a minotaur. <laughs> a mini mini minotaur. Come on, don't don't. But run then what you do no. is you just move Wraith Marid to no, here, and then I, can't I won't. Get I your promise. I banner. promise I won't move Wraith Marid there. I then promise. I can't get this. <laughs> and I kind of like the idea of Blackjaw kicking him to death. <laughs> like, I love the imagery. He <laughs> just turns around and boots oh, him. Oh, that's so dark. Because like just oh. just like. Looking at the dice I'm rolling, yep. the damage on his whip, I believe, is five. Oh, come on. No, four damage dice. So come it's on, just not... Rangosh. The four damage dice just isn't likely to get it done. If I could get a strengthen on him, which I can't, okay. then I'd be a lot more willing. You're too busy jawing me to death. Yeah. So because for Sorry, this do, game... Sorry, do the big Jesse move. Because for this game, I am the pride of Steamforged. <laughs> <laughs> Rangosh. <laughs> He got what he came for. Yeah, he did. He did. 
Uh, well One, done, two, sir. three. Oh, yeah. Uh, he's going to turn around. He's just going to admire his work. <laughs> So he's gone one, two to there, Good. and then he's yeah. turned around and gone back one. You see just how big he is. Like, you think Wraith Marid is, is big, and then Rangor stands behind him and is like, nope, nope, you're not. I think you're a big man. Um... However, you are still winning the turn currently. <laughs> Silver linings and all that. <laughs> um, okay, 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 I can... Part okay. of me is tempted to see if I can get Rodri with these orcs. <laughs> Kill him with that's, followers. That's absolutely <laughs> brutal. Um, all right. Wraith Marid's going to go. Yep. We're going to just go with what feels good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do slash and dash, uh, range two on two yep. blackjaw. Um, three dodge. Plusing an accuracy onto it. Nice. For a seven. That's how much damage dice I rolled. We got it. <laughs> I'm going to glaze past what you said. <laughs> I'm going to glaze right over it. Not even pretend you said it. Uh, armor three. <laughs> yes. Armor three, three damage dice. Nice! <gasps> Big it's dog. Two damage. Two damage. That black jaw, yeah? Yeah. Uh, so he's got four health left. Uh, and you get uh, hit the hit effect. Uh, move two. Gonna headbutt. Oh, I'm scared now. Four dice. Yeah, three. No! Again, Come with the on! two. Again. I have five, <laughs> five <laughs> damage dice coming up. <laughs> Come on! Five, is that um, it? Is that it? Just, I get to move a target two spaces. <sighs> Wait, I didn't hit. No, I didn't hit, so it's no hit effect, sorry. Yes. Oh, is there a hit effect? No it hit is effect. a hit effect. It is a you didn't you didn't hit, so there is no move. Oh, damn it. <laughs> that was a potential five post for the damage. Wraith, buddy. It's not his fault he got me <laughs> as the dice roller for his fate. <laughs> How horrible an image you ever think you have a really bad day, it's just because I'm above you rolling the just dice, rolling for, your, dice. for your day. Yeah, yeah, are you going to yeah, miss yeah, the bus? Like, Looks like oh, you are. This, this are you going to burn your dinner? <laughs> Looks like you are. <laughs> oh wait, there's a skill modifier in that. Are you going to get splashed by a puddle while you're waiting for the bus? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a crit 20, you've just drowned. <laughs> <laughs> What's a crit 20? I don't know, I don't know what this thing you speak. A crit 20? Oh, no, I know what a crit 20 is, I just don't roll them. Oh, <laughs> so it's like this thing, um, so 20 sided dice, it has a 20 on it. I've never seen it, man. It doesn't have 20 dice, 20 sides that all say one on them. I'm aware that's the only one you see, but there are other numbers on it. I am, I am the traditional role player who jumps up the chandelier, tries to do something and epically dramatic, falls, falls out the window. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I've played Vampire Masquerade where my party turned against me and used me as a body to jump out of a burning building and land on so they could get out safely because I just couldn't help <laughs> them. Yeah, it's, it's... Right, go on then. Wraith you and Rodri both gone. The genuinely interesting thing here is, like, my path to winning this turn isn't as kind of guaranteed yeah. as it may look. If you feel to kill Rodri... these are hard to get rid of, yeah. and they have a boon. Mm -hmm. My The one point from here mm -hmm. is my best route. Yeah. That's... But it's not guaranteed. It's not guaranteed, no. no in no way guaranteed. Um, but I think... What do we think, as? Do I go with Blackjaw and see if we can get Rodri? I'm Rodrigo? not going to give you advice on how to kill me. Oh, man. OK, <laughs> we're going to go with Blackjaw. Uh, and he is going to go for a kick. Uh, he can't go for a kick on Rodri. Why? Because it has to target a follower. And Rodri's Ooh. not a follower. Which is interesting, because that actually no. means there's a, a way smarter thing to do here, but there's a really weird route to get there. The followers are better for killing him. Yep. And he's better for killing, killing the him. follower. Yep. <laughs> Do but it. But if I move him to here, he's in the way of the deep boop, 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 boop. There is, there is another way. I think you're going to be all right. There's another I think, way. I think you've got it. There's another way. These guys are going. Where are they going? One, two. Yep. Now correct me if I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Sure. Well, that's convenient because they have a range three attack. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, it's, Can I get an adjudicator to count the hexes again, please? It, it might not be do three. much damage. I feel like I'm getting sucked into a trap here. What are you doing, Az? Well, I've said I'm doing it now, so I'm doing it. Okay. Are these guys going to do anything? Are they going to advance? You want to move them as part of this? Uh, yes. They're going to advance backwards. Mm. Which some would argue is not an advance, <laughs> but it's what the rule book says. It's so. a retreat. Admit it. You're just a big Jesse. It's um, 
looking for people that ran away. What's the word I'm looking for? There's a word for that. The nope, it's gone. There's the where's a word for the guys that run away. Like a fancy military word, like betrayers, but I forget what it is. Deserters. Deserters. Thank you, Rodan. <laughs> that's not the action of chasing them down, though. I thought that's no, what no, you wanted. No, no, they're looking for deserters. Oh, okay. They're on the hunt for people that have run away. Okay, well, come on. I've got dessert to go and eat. <laughs> <laughs> Does that make you a deserter? <laughs> that makes me a deserter. Sorry, that was yeah. terrible. Um, we're going to shoot. We're going to shoot Rodri with the um, with the human. No, no, you're not. Have you seen his shield? So it's accuracy five. Uh, dodge two. Hits. So only three damage. So I need a spike here. Protection four. You do need to see. You can hit, you can get six. So yeah, five or six. I do need a spike here. No. Nope. Um, that is them done. So I've got whirlpools and the house guard yet. So the house guard are up. They're going to do a recruit. They're going to rock in here. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And then they're going to attack here. Yes. Um, good. Actually, you know what? I'll screw it. We'll put them both together. Okay. Attack here. Yep. Um, so, sword strike. Five dice. Yeah. Dodge. Three. Uh, dodge three, yeah. Yes. Nailed it. Flip, I had a, I had a pause for a second when I saw all those blanks. <laughs> <laughs> um, four dice then. And armor three. Armor three. That armor, bro. That armor. It's worth it. Oh, nothing. yes. Awesome. We'll Which take one, one dime. Go on. Uh, the ugly one. Uh, oh, uh, well. <laughs> <laughs> now you have to decide which one's ugly. Uh, this one, because he hasn't got a helmet on. Uh, so he, by proxy, is uglier, because so I can I got, see I him as him. You did. Which does actually complicate things It a does, bit. doesn't it? Only a little bit. Don't get carried away. I know. I got a point. I'm just elated. I just don't know where to go. Yes, I do. <laughs> I think. Come on, household guard. So, I am going to go for... A fire... <laughs> I know what I want to do, but I can't work out the right order to do it in. There is a right order. Right, I'm going all in on a stupid idea. Yes. Okay. My favorite kind of idea. Ultimate. So you get to make a skill with plus two accuracy plus one damage. Okay. Going for fiery axe on Rodri. Oh, this is amazing. So it's accuracy <laughs> six. Uh, two dodge, I don't think. Oh, come on, come on. Roll like as, roll like as. No, not even close. It's um, five damage dice. Four protection, you need five on the dice. This is with your plus one, yeah? Yes, this is with my plus oh, one. Oh, so anything four or less. It's four yes. on the nose. Yes. No. Rodri. So I've still got another, still got another one. So my second <sighs> one will be to do a fireball on this hex here. <sighs> so it's accuracy four, and I get. Why, to why are you getting a third action? Oh no, yeah, because your your legendary oh. triggers the first action yes. skill. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. So oh no. I'm gonna go for a fireball. Yep. On these guys. They've so got I think minus the, one dodge. I think the right thing to do was to actually use my ultimate on that, on those First, guys. Yeah. Just to basically all but to guarantee yeah. two points, which swings it back my way. Yeah, yeah. This was a bad idea. But uh, that idea so one fun. dodge. Yep. Oh, yep. There's that damage. There's that I damage. <laughs> and you're looking at three protection usually, but they're beside Rodri, so they've got four protection. And I've only got three dice at it. <sighs> No, that was just the first guy, though. And then the second yep. guy. So again, two dodge. Does hit. Four protection. Only three Come on, on guys. Ooh. Yes. Blackjaw, you it, failed. Is man. there any chance at all that I take this round? I By having not enough followers for you to kill? Is that a... I think you might. How far can these guys move in this? Uh, how far? Can... Who hasn't gone? The orcs. Uh, so the orcs haven't gone, and that's it. Oh, man. Blackjaw has now gone, uh, and that is Blackjaw's activation. So how far can the orcs move? The orcs can move to two. Oh man, you could recruit an orc though. Well, that doesn't really matter. The orcs can move two. Okay, so whirlpools are up. We're going to do a uh, recruit. Yeah, seems. This was fine. My, this was my soften up turn. They're going to take on the reinforce. 
uh-huh. from Real Madrid because yeah. you've not taken his boons off him. They've been sitting with him from the start. Of the I game. don't need to. Um, he's not. He's not a problem for me. Then I'm an experienced <laughs> Wraith mid Wraith Madrid dealer with a uh, dealer with <laughs> um, one, two, three. So they're going to current to there. This guy's going to want to. There's better ways to deal with Wraith Marid than start petitions about him as. No, <laughs> no, no, come on. <laughs> I'm, if, if, I'm, if anything, the petition's not needed anymore because I'm proving he's... It depends on who's piloting him. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing to do, with, uh, to do with how bad I am. And that guy's just going to stay where he is, actually. He's not going to move. Stay put. Yeah. So okay. that's it. They're done. Just a recruit and then current and obviously trait. So is that them. everyone that you've got done? So I've just got my savages to do and the only way I can possibly win this turn is if this one savage was able to take out both of these dwarves This by is himself, correct. Which seems unlikely. Macho, macho man. Time to step so up there's to only the one other way I can see this working out. Uh-huh. No. No. <laughs> oh my God. If he does this. Oh my God. God, it, no, this would suck so much. <laughs> Imagine oh, the scenes. And then, what, of, of the dwarves walking out of fireballs, walking yeah. through kicks, and dodging, so and then two orcs. <laughs> bye bye. So two orcs. So they are making a cleaving strike. So they've already moved. This is the last activation of this entire turn. If Accuracy you, three. If you kill Rodri, you win the game. If you don't, we go to another turn. Accuracy three. Dodge two. <gasps> That's not they two. Hit. Two blanks and a two again. Are you kidding? It's Pro- four dice. Protection four. And so four five dice. will do it. I, I'm uncomfortable in my being right now. <laughs> oh, I'm the, you're the worst person. You are the worst person. I can't. I'm <laughs> leaving. I'm de miking. Get me out of here. <laughs> Oh my god! Orcs, 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 orcs. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I probably destroyed the mic. Well played, sir. Well played. <laughs> Man, what a. Like, because it would have been what with that? So, four points to two, we're going into another round. You would have had to win two more rounds. But I didn't, because that's mine now, and I'm on five. I'm on one. The pride of Steam Forged. Good game, sir. That was that was epic. Every turn, every single turn did not go the way I thought it was going to go. No, <laughs> every was, single turn was like at the start of the game. I was like, our ah, Rodri goes down pretty quick here, yep. no problem. Oh, Blackjaw, that didn't go well. I forgot that I can't target you with kick. You made My the most right damaging, call. Damaging, most reliable one. But you made the right call in the end. Like they got through to him eventually. <laughs> <laughs> what a way to end yeah well look thank you so much guys we hope you're enjoying our stuff with God Tier um, with Mythic Games we hope to play lots more games with the guys here at Steamforge and lots of different other games as well we'll be sharing them with you in the future as part of just what we want to do with our community and sharing and growing in the future if you're interested in the game yourself obviously go and have a look in Kickstarter and check it out it's definitely worth a look absolutely and thanks for watching thank you Alex for delivering me uh, a fantastically enjoyable game that was great thank you very much we'll leave your comments below guys and we will catch you again soon